What's going on guys, Team Mart here and welcome back to another episode of Black Ops 3 Gun Guide. This is a series to go through all the weapons in the game, breaking them down for you guys in 3 minutes or less, giving you only the most important stats, tips, and class setups to help you guys become better Black Ops 3 players. So in this video, we are going to be taking a look at the VMP. It's definitely one of the strongest SMGs in the game. It's a fantastic weapon and if you use this thing, you're gonna have a very good time. So uh, first of all, let's take a look at the iron sights. They're actually one of my favorite iron sights in the game. You guys can see they're very open and very clear. They don't block up too much space. There's not like a giant, you know, half circle over top from or anything like that. It's just a simple single line right there in the middle. That's what you aim at enemies. And they're very, very effective, especially in the kind of typical SMG ranges you're going to be in, which is, you know, short to medium range. Now, next up, let's talk about the damage. So this thing has a three-part damage profile. It does 30 damage from 0 to 14 meters, 23 damage from 14 to 28 meters, and then 19 damage after 28 meters. So up close, you're doing 30 damage. Middle distance, you're doing about 23 damage. And then at far distance, you're doing 9 damage, which means this weapon is a 4 to 6 shot kill. Up close, it's 4 shots. In the middle, it's 5. And then at long distance, it's going to take 6 shots to kill. Now, although that's not the best damage profile in the game for an SMG, where it really excels is the rate of fire. You guys can see here, it has a 909 rounds per minute rate of fire, which is absolutely insane. The only SMG that beats that is the Vesper. It's one of the fastest shooting guns in the game. So, uh, you know, although it doesn't have the highest damage per bullet, you're putting a lot of bullets down range and this thing is an absolute killing machine. Now, where this thing falls a little bit short is in the recoil. So I'm gonna put the slider right here. It's actually a pretty bad recoil, and you guys are gonna see why. It kicks up into the right very, very heavily. Check out this recoil plot. This is like 10,000 shots shot on this thing. You guys can see it doesn't kick left at all. It only kicks up into the right, and although that's pretty hard to get used to at first, once you do get used to it, it's actually really predictable. So every time you shoot this thing, especially at medium to longer ranges, you wanna pull down and left on your aiming stick to be able to compensate for that and keep it shooting in the middle of your screen. So uh, that's uh, that's just how that thing works. It's tough to get used to, but once you master it, it's an absolute monster of a weapon. Now, next up for the magazine size, it's super solid for an SMG. 40 rounds in normal mag, 56 with extended mags. Reload speed's pretty solid, 1.8 seconds. If you have any bullets left, 2.4 seconds if your mag's completely empty. Now, let's talk about my recommended attachment. So uh, I really, like, I don't feel like this thing needs any optics. I feel like the iron sights are super, super good. So no optics on this thing. As for actual attachments, the grip is definitely my number one recommendation. Like I said, that recoil can kind of get away from you sometimes. That really helps out. Quick draw is great on SMGs for getting shots on target very quickly, especially at close quarters. Uh, the long barrel is also pretty good in this thing. The laser sight isn't bad if you hip fire a lot. And then finally, fast mags is also a good option for all those close quarter gunfights. So uh, yeah, there you guys have it. That, my friends, is the VMP in Black Ops 3. Definitely one of the best guns in the game. You can't go wrong with using this thing. It's uh, a very, very solid SMG and uh, you know if you get used to that recoil then you're really going to be able to slay with this thing so uh, yeah there you guys have it hope you guys enjoyed thank you guys so much for watching I will catch you guys later leave a comment with which weapon you guys want me to cover in the next episode of the Black Ops 3 Gun Guide thanks again for watching thumbs up if you guys enjoyed check out these two videos on screen if you haven't seen them yet peace out guys